guys, it's Chip Review Games, or Adam will go back to some more Black Ops 3 Zombies, and in today's video, I want to talk a little bit about Gorat Krovi, and possibly a new perk being found, not in the trailer, but actually in the dynamic theme that you can download onto your PlayStation 4. I think if you have the season pass, this theme is actually free. And if you actually look at this theme and you zoom in and you if you're if you're on the notifications tab, it should be kind of right in between your your friends tab or your profile tab and your trophy tab. And right in between there you can see Something that looks like a perk machine and if you really zoom into it You can see what looks like to be a Shiva on the wall and then beside that it looks like there is some kind of a perk machine. So say this is actually a perk machine. The first thing that I kind of noticed here is the Shiva on the wall. Even if it is the Shiva, I honestly have no idea. But to me, it does look like the Shiva. And the Shiva is usually in the spawn room, right? So for every map so far in Black Ops 3, on Shadows it was the spawn room, the Giant, on Dryzen Draka, and on Zetsu Binoshima, the Shiva was located in the spawn room. Now it could be a different weapon but the reason why I think that this is the spawn room or at least the spawn area is in the actual trailer there's an area that looks very similar to this and you can actually see quick revive there and uh, quick revive again is uh, usually in the spawn area and it looks exactly like this area in this PlayStation theme image so I'm thinking that this is at least the spawn area and why would they have a perk so close to the spawn area if they don't want you really accessing that perk early on so this perk is probably going to be a cheap perk even if it actually is a perk so since this perk is so close to spawn it's got to be relatively cheap and if it's cheap that means it probably doesn't do all that much and the first thing that i think of i want you guys to help me with this in the comment section below give me some ideas on what you think this could possibly be but the first thing that comes to mind for me is uh, something to do with fire because you got a dragon on this map and we did see in the trailer the dragon actually breathing fire on the zombies so the dragon can actually do damage to the zombies and probably you as well so i'm thinking that this perk would only protect you from the fire and if that is the case say that's all it does just a really basic perk very similar to quick revive and solo something very basic uh, i really think that there should be five perk slots on this map instead of just four because the wonder fizz is coming back for sure we, we've seen that in the trailer so that means we're probably going to have like Widow's Wine, uh, Deadshot Daiquiri, and Electric Cherry in there. And we have like the original four perks, most likely coming back, you know, Stamina Up is in there. So we're going to have a lot of perks on this map. And if fire is a really big factor on this map, I really hope they're going to have more than um, just four perk slots because, you know, you don't want to die from fire or something like that. But then again, guys, we don't even know if it's actually a perk machine. At first, I thought that it was actually actually just a cobble gum machine but when you kind of zoom in on it you can see that the base of this whatever it is 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 a lot larger than the base of a cobble gum machine so it definitely isn't that um it, it could have something to do with some kind of feature on the map who knows it could be a trap who knows what this thing could be but uh say this specific thing is not a perk I still think that this map definitely needs a perk. And one thing I hear a lot of is PhD Flopper is coming back because when you actually saw the part of the trailer where the guy had the NX Shadow Claws or explosions and he wasn't taking any damage, I don't really think that indicates that PhD Flopper is coming back. I would love for that to come back. I think that would be pretty awesome, but I think that will never happen just because we have that danger closest gobble gum and it would make that gobble gum pretty much useless. So I don't really see PhD Flopper coming back. One thing that I hear as well is kind of like a banana colada type thing where you would slide and there'd be like this path of fire behind you and it would kill zombies. That also 
would be really awesome. Uh, but again, I just really don't see that happening at all. But honestly, guys, you, you never know. We're going to find out in like uh, less than two weeks. So we're pretty close to the release already of this map. We'll find out very, very soon. And whatever it is, I'm sure it's going to be pretty awesome. Like, look at Widow's Wine. That's the newest perk we have. And that's an amazing perk. A really awesome, useful perk that, you know, a lot of people want on every single map so I'm sure whatever this perk is even if it is a perk I'm sure there will be a new perk on this map if there isn't that's gonna be kind of crazy because usually you get a new perk with like every DLC that happened in Black Ops 1 and in Black Ops 2 and it's DLC 3 guys it's time for a new perk there will be one on this map and I'm sure whatever it is Treyarch is going to come up with something pretty awesome so anyways guys that is all for now if you enjoyed this video make sure to leave it a thumbs up guys like I said we're getting really close to the launch of Goroth Krovi and subscribe for a ton of content tutorials live streams all that good stuff and i'll see you guys in the next one peace out